welcome if you're new welcome 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 if you came back welcome so today i'm doing a plan with me uh my monthly spread setting that up on my inkwell press i'm using the nikki plus three erin condren monthly planner you know set kit but you know obviously i don't have a monthly erin uh, condren so i'm working with my inkwell press I'm just, you know, giving myself another trial run to see if I really want to purchase the Erin Condren opposed to working with what I have because we are still on a budget. <laughs> so right now you see me, I am writing out the corners, which I hate that Inkwell Press colors go to the corner. Like there should be a stop because what if I want to put a kit? I can't put a kit around the, I can't put a kit around the little, what is that? Hole punch area. So that's highly, highly annoying. But you know, you got to work with what you got. I'll shoot them an email and hopefully they'll fix that next time around because I may not even be purchasing it. So I wide it out and this is what we have. It looks kind of dingy, but once again, work with what you have. <laughs> so I'm putting on the header where it says October. Um, there was a little overlay, so I'm kind of fixing that off screen um and yeah i fixed it it looks good it's covering the dates and this is just me doing measurements because i'm thinking about making my own monthly kits um i took a picture of it so don't worry i didn't lose it just because i put the stickers over it but i'm trying to be budget friendly and create my own stickers because this this sticker kit was 19 dollars. it was expensive plus shipping like it's a lot and then you, it takes like four or five weeks to get to you so yeah so right now i am just putting the dates the special events such as yonkapur um think what else is this month yes rosh hashanah i cannot pronounce that so excuse my um pronunciation then we have columbus day which is i don't really care to celebrate but it's there so let me just put it there um anybody that knows the real history knows why we don't really jack columbus because what did he discover not a damn thing but yes yeah, so i'm just looking through my book of stickers which there is going to be a video on that situation um it will be up shortly after this one and I'm just putting you know no school because I don't have school those days that I'm putting it on I actually have no school what one two three four days out of this month so mm, it's, it's gonna be a real fun October and I have a real hell of a November because you know they try to make you catch up on the work that you missed those days but yeah so I'm just you know sticking them on then I noticed that I didn't do my date dots um not date dots but my days of the week stickers so I'm putting that on this is a very very rushed plan with me because it is sped on four times eight times the speed because you know I don't want to keep you here all day I don't but you know how's your September went because obviously y'all noticed I didn't post a uh cash envelope stuffing in a minute <laughs> because September was a rough rough month I fell off the bandwagon a couple of times and other stuff popped up so right now I'm just marking my LS's birthday uh, her birthday is the 3rd of October so you know we just gotta give her a nice little full box and some stickers so I'm um, adding it too. And then the also thing, the bad thing about the sticker kit is that the boxes don't really fit my planner. So there's always a little room. If you see it right there between the day of the week and the sticker itself, there's some room. Um, it's either that or it's too wide. But like the Columbus, if you see it right there, it's leaping over to the next box. But we work with what we got. So let's let's do it I guess <laughs> so right now I am just doing everything off screen so I'm putting out my midterm stickers 
because I don't know why that wasn't marked. I think I was waiting for me to plan this video. Um, so yeah, so that's a take home midterm that I'm writing down the breast cancer walk that we will be participating in the 20th of next month. Well, this month, depending on when this comes up. <laughs> So what I do when I pre-plan, I just put like poster stickers and I just mark it up my calendar so that I know what's going on and I'm not sitting here for a long time while I'm recording this or doing it out by myself or whatever. So we got that done. Now I'm doing my sidebar just to cover the writing that I did. And that is going to be my events and appointments. And I'm just going to add the event that I will be participating in the third because you know I already put something on the third which is her birthday so I just put on the side so I don't forget so yeah so I am writing my Sigmaversary which is basically the a year that I've made in this sorority and we got some plans. I'm not recording it, so follow me on Francine um, underscore at Instagram. So, <laughs> so yeah, so I will, I'm putting that on the 30th and it's not sticking. And I shouldn't have put it that low because I wanted to put a little underlay situation, but you know, whatever. So yeah, so I put that date down because it's very important to me. When I get some more stickers, I'll probably add more de uh, decorations for that date. But, you know, I don't got many decorative stickers. I have more functional than decorative. So I'm just adding, you know, a few more stickers just to pretty up that area because I am limited on decorative stickers. Then I am writing... One of my events, another one of the events that we are doing this month, which is boobies and bagels, which is basically talking about breast cancer and having like a brunch and discussing how to properly check yourself and the issues of breast cancer and how to prevent it. So a little spear, splur, 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 splur. Anyways, so on to the next, I am putting Fright Fest, which now we changed it to t apple picking but i'm not going back and writing that out because it already looks pretty ish and then my pen act obviously died <laughs> so yeah so we're we were supposed to go to fright fest the fifth but now we're just considering apple picking because it is a little cheaper than fright fright fest so i just finished writing a the events the boobies and bagels on my event tab on my sidebar and I am finishing up writing my bills I did not show me writing my bills because the camera kept cutting in and out but I did write my bills on these small little tabs and I placed them on the days that the bills will be happening so that I can you know be aware that a bill is coming out that day because this is my school planner not my budget planner so I don't put the big stickers of the bill basically my bill stickers that I sell on my Etsy shop which for I forgot to mention that my midterm essays and lab do are from my Etsy shop so if you are looking to purchase them the link will be down below but nonetheless this is my planner I'm not fully done because I forgot to put in my tabs um, for the month for the previous month and the next month to cover it up because I don't need those boxes but I will be doing that shortly in this little clip so I'm basically showing you I don't have much to do this month um yeah I'm doing it right now I thought I wanted to put it on the sideboard because I don't really use my sideboard but I was like you know what let me just use it for what its purpose is so needless to say this is how my planner is looking like. I don't really have much going on, but I will be putting things in as I go because I basically plan as I go. Um, this is just a setup of what to expect of next month. And yeah, so I think I'm going to start doing videos like look at my old planning of last month or last week. Basically, 
a backwards plan with me and see what happened that week or that month because this plan with me is basically an estimate but yeah so i'm just putting this off camera i'm almost done and if you like this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe because you know why not why not so this spread is actually really pretty i love the design nikki plus three is actually amazing when it comes to her stuff so you know check it out but you know don't forget to check out this channel